So, you want to know who I am? Well, that depends on where you heard of me. Tim Halen 420 in the Social Justice Warrior chat room, Cuck Smasher 420 on 4chan, the list goes on. But the most people know me as Swaglord 420. I'm a troll. My name is Emily. I went to Boston University for uh, undergrad for journalism. And it seemed like a good point in my life where I was able to devote myself full time to my own blog, Beer is Near, Have No Fear, and immediately developed a following. Um, had a really nice little community talking about beers in a really real way. And so I did that for about a good three years. And so I decided to start my own YouTube channel. I started turling, trolling. IRL, that's in real life for you morons, because I was bored. My best handles had already been banned from most of the message boards I went to, and anytime I tried to start a new fake profile, Wastebook was onto it like that. So the next step was inevitable. I had to take it to the streets. I started posting videos of my turls online. Why anonymously? Are you a stupid mother I'm a troll. Fuck a doodle do, mother So, yeah, the... The YouTube channel started off really awesome to, to seg from uh, from my blog into a video blogosphere was a really kind of awesome thing. Yeah, it started out great and uh, pretty quickly things kind of started to go downhill. One person made one comment saying all kinds of the most grandiose of negative things that one could imagine. A lot of the comments came from people like, I'm still in high school, you know. 97, way underage, not even, you know what, not even able to drink, I can do this, mm-hmm. God, some of the comments, some of them were just plain, plain as just, that bitch is dumb, that bitch doesn't know. There was a video where my cat was in the background because she's adorable, uh, her name is Meowmix, in case anyone's wondering. People started commenting on my cat. Your cat's that bitch is fat. I bet you your cat, that cat should just choke on a <laughs> you know, stuff like that about my cat. And it kind of just spiraled from there, just just a downward, downward, downward cyclone of just passive, pessimistic comments. Oh, God. Eventually, the YouTube comments just started becoming threats. The end of the end was when someone posted my home address. That was basically it for me. I ended up cutting my YouTube channel. It just wasn't worth it anymore. The first time I met Swaglord420, I was... I was walking down the street and I heard this commotion. You know, it was it was this one one man just kind of yelling and another comment yelling and then comments back. Uh, I got closer and closer and um, I didn't know it at the time, but the guy who was yelling and kind of instigating the whole th the whole argument was such a <laughs> Here I am doing my own thing, getting stuff done. When here we go again. Another woman with an opinion to share. And so, you know, I tried to assuage the situation. F you, you know what, you know what? Hope you like ice cream. I was shocked. It was one of the best turls I'd ever seen in my life. It happened to coincide right with the time that I decided to, to uh, end my YouTube channel. It was, it was a glorious, blissful moment in that slamming of the ice cream cone in his face. Base 420 swag lord in that moment i realized that my newfound purpose in life uh i was gonna troll the trolls hey emily i never say this but thanks for your help these cancer kids are gonna cry harder than all the tree huggers combined Oh sh! They called the cops! Give me the camera! Quick, quick, give me the camera! Hey! Hey, what are you doing? Get back here! Get back here! I guess what they say is true. Never trust a troll.